And with those rain chances and certainly colder temperatures on Thursday, lots of people are asking where you can trick or treat and stay warm and dry. 10 News reporter Grace King joins us with some answers from an early trunk or treat going on in West Knoxville. Grace, tell us about those backup plans. Well, Robin and John, one suggestion is celebrating a little bit early. And if you take a look behind me, that's exactly what they're doing here at this trunk or treat in West Knoxville. There are a bunch of similar trick or treats happening across East Tennessee tonight. You can also make plans to trick or treat indoors on Halloween. Publix, the Foothills Mall and multiple senior living centers are all hosting indoor events Thursday. And one mom says you can also easily turn your home into a trick or treating adventure. We'll go trick or treating in our house which typically consists of turning off all the lights, hiding a bunch of the good candy bars, the good stuff, and um, giving them a flashlight and letting them go find their candy in the house. And throughout the day, we've seen organizers start to move their events indoors to help you stay warm and dry. We'll continue to update you with those locations as we get them. Robin and John.